Time for a look at arts and lifestyle. And it's Monday. That means it's mm, 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 mm. Monday. <laughs> <laughs> and a good one tonight. Uh, one. Yeah, a very good one because it's a, a restaurant in downtown Victoria that is a little bit of a, a twist between traditional French food and a little bit of a West Coast flair to it. And it's all prepared by a, a creative culinary mind that is dealing with a little bit of sleep deprivation. Jeffrey Davidson is tired. I, I just had a new kid. How old? Um, five weeks old. Congratulations. Thanks. His name is Maximus, and he will eventually join his sister in eating gourmet baby food. Actually, my, my, uh, my daughter, who's almost two, um, eats truffle brie cheese all the time. When Davidson's not cooking for his family, he's creating French food at Bon Rouge Bistro, which inevitably begins with butter. It brings body, it brings flavor, um, has a higher smoke point than oil, so you're actually going to caramelize your, your product. He's making bouillabaisse. It's a classic French stew. Which includes potatoes, leeks, and fennel. And now I'm just going to add some prawns, uh, some arctic char, some salt spring island mussels. Davidson says the owner of Bon Rouge is so committed to local ingredients, he's bought a 10-acre farm near Sydney. Right now we've got 82 chickens out there. There's going to be pigs coming in. All produce is going to come out of there. Cole says their charcuterie plates feature local cheese, which is proving popular with a late-night crowd. The ambiance is very romantic. People are very relaxed when they're here, and they just kind of, like, settled in and stay for the night. Back in the kitchen, Davidson adds the house-made bouillabaisse broth. Which we make from uh, saffron and uh, fish stock, some tomatoes and some orange zest. Once the mussels have opened up, the stew is poured into a bowl and served with baked toast and anchovy butter. Some garlic and herbs. And what does that bring to this? Uh, it just brings a texture, a little bit of crisp. The final meal, the product of almost 17 years experience. But being a chef is a lifelong process. Being so, a parent is a lifelong and being process. And being a parent is a lifelong process as well. And in the end, he says he just wants to do his best for his kids at home and for you on the plate. And you find Bon Rouge in downtown Victoria on Courtney Street near government, and it is part of this year's Dine Around event, and you can find full details at bonrouge.ca.